Big story at 10, traffic woes at Country USA. Big names on the lineup bringing in record crowds organizers have never seen before, leaving guests waiting hours just to get into the campgrounds. That includes NBC26's Alex Hagan, who's live in Oshkosh tonight. Alex, how long were you stuck in line? Well, Stacey, I have to say, I waited about three hours to get onto the grounds. As you can see, the concert is well underway. Many people already here, but there's still a line of traffic outside the grounds. People waiting in bumper to bumper traffic, waiting just as long as me, if not longer. Forget the mud. Very frustrating. It's the amount of time these guests waited just to get into the campgrounds that's putting a minor damper on this concert. Four hours. Like two and a half hours. Three hours. And put that down as the longest wait time to get into Country USA. This is probably our fifth year and it's we've never had to wait. I mean, 10 minutes at the most. If they're going to spend this kind of money, I would, I would assume they would have things more squared away. But frankly, it's no surprise, even to security, with a star-studded lineup this week. Organizers estimate more than 30,000 people in tonight's crowd. So this traffic is expected. Really kind of limited with what we can do to alleviate the traffic backups. Um, there's one main camper entrance, and obviously Tuesday night is a huge camper traffic night. Still, not a good time. Sitting in a car and not being at a campsite where you're having fun with all your friends and drinking and eating. But on the bright side, this may be the last night for this kind of traffic, as most of the campers are all settled in. Now, obviously, the majority of people are already here, but law enforcement encouraging people to be patient as they make their way onto the campgrounds. Reporting live from Country USA in Oshkosh, Alex Hagan, NBC26.